After successfully updating your Simapro database server, the next step is to update the Simapro client software. Download the Setup Simapro installer from the same update menu. Once it is downloaded, double click the installer. Select the language you want to use during installation. Then, follow the instructions on the setup wizard. If you also have the single user installation alongside to your multi user installation, choose the multi user installation to update. Please keep your CMAP registration name and code at hand since you will be asked to insert them upon installation. Unless you choose another location, CMAPRO will pick up the following default location for the software. The current CMAPRO software will be uninstalled and then replaced with the updated CMAPRO version. This action will not remove any of your databases. You have now successfully updated the software. Note that you will still need to perform separate action to update your database. This step will be explained in the next part of the video. Now, after updating only the software, what changes can we expect to happen? Essentially, you get a newer version of the software that contains newer software features and less bugs. The database contents will remain unchanged. A software update will not change any libraries, projects, or methods in your database. You will not see any result changes either because you haven't yet updated the database. The next step after a client update will be to perform a database update. You can find the instructions in the part 3 of the multi-user update video.